Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. We give God praise. We give God glory. Hey, Sister Clark, God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. We're going to get us some rest. God bless you, Pastor Edwards. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Come on. Come on in, everybody. Come on in. Hallelujah. Glory to the name of the Lord. We give God praise. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Hallelujah. This is the day that the Lord hath made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Thank you for as you come on, please like and share. Sister Clark, Sister Joanne. Hallelujah, my moderators. Thank God for you. Amen. Hallelujah. Leave intercessory prayer and come right on. Hallelujah. Come on in, everybody. Come on in. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. We thank God for doing great and mighty things. Hallelujah. Glory to God. This is the day that the Lord hath made. We're gonna rejoice and be glad in it. Amen, amen, amen. I hope everyone can see me well, hallelujah. As we go before the throne of grace today. Hallelujah, Lord, we thank you for being with us in this Bible study tonight. Hallelujah, this, hallelujah, not according to Hallelujah, man's way, but according to your way. Let the words of my mouth, the meditation of my heart. Father, let it be acceptable in thy sight. O Lord, our strength and our redeemer. Come on, everybody. Let's give God praise. Hey, y'all, just give God praise. Have your way tonight, Lord. Hallelujah. I want you to think through my mind and speak through my vocal cords. This is the day that the Lord hath made. Hallelujah. How excellent. Hallelujah, the Lord is in all the earth. We give God praise and we give God glory. Hallelujah. There he is. Hallelujah. There he is. Hallelujah. God bless you, Sister Yarborough. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God is. Oh, God is a great and mighty God. God is a very present help in the time of trouble. Amen, 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 amen. We are looking to the Lord to speak today. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, let's give God a little praise. Just, just give God a little praise. He's a great God. He's a mighty God. Hallelujah. This is the day. Hallelujah. You woke us up this morning. You started us on our way. Hallelujah. We want to tell you, thank you, God. You brought us over to this point. No matter where you are listening to us, whether you are uh, 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 just in your living room, in your bedroom, in your kitchen, whether you're laying on your couch, laying on your bed, we just thank God that the word of God will be a blessing to you all tonight. Hallelujah. We are praying and we are thanking God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For his great goodness and his many blessings and we just give God the praise oh hallelujah we lift up the night just please as you come on please like and share hallelujah whether you can uh, uh, come on for a little while or a long time be with us all throughout we just thank God for you amen hallelujah hallelujah come on in saints come on in 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 hallelujah Glory to God. Thank God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you. Hallelujah. Sister Knight, I see my brother David out there. God bless you. Sister Knight, all the way from Atlanta, my brother from Gadsden County. Amen. Hallelujah. I see the Artesian family lining up and coming on. And we thank God for you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. This is our the regular Tuesday night Bible study of Artesian Christian Center place where we are flowing in the favor of God. We are trusting and we are believing in him. Hallelujah. And we're looking to the Lord. Hallelujah. 
We're looking to the Lord. Hallelujah. We're looking to the Lord. Hallelujah. We're looking to the Lord. You know, we, the last time, hallelujah, since we've been here from the last Bible study to this Bible study, so much has happened in this nation. So much has happened in just the seven days from the last Bible study to this Bible study. We have had a whirlwind of things to happen here in this nation. My God, my God, my God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to God, glory to God. You know, we are on, if you look at the description of the Bible study, you'll see that we're on um, part 19. We're still on prophecy and the prophetic. Hallelujah. And thinking, you know, because we're not walking according to our will and our way. This is a this is a time where we are now. Hallelujah. We're not leaning to our own understanding. We're acknowledging God in all our ways. Hallelujah. We're not leaning to our own understanding. We're trusting, hallelujah, in him. Glory to God. We're leaning wholly and depending upon him. Hallelujah. This is, this is, we've said on a many occasion, glory to God. And you all, y'all know this is true. We cannot play. This is no time for playing. This is not a time to play. You know, we've had some play time, but right now we, the, the time we're in is so serious. And, and you as people of God, thank you for sharing sister Knight. And you as people of God and all those that have shared, I thank God for you all that come on and that do that. We appreciate it. That's helping us spread the gospel, the good news of Jesus Christ. This is the one thing that we, that we find out. Hallelujah. With the very serious issues that's facing <clears throat> the, this, this, the, the, the very serious issues that's facing all of us collectively right now. We need to be on the same page on how we are united in prayer. Hallelujah. <clears throat> we need to be on the same page. We need to be hearing <clears throat> from the Lord. It's not a real, a real big time for opinion. Just don't have time for a whole lot of opinion. We need a true word from the Lord. Hallelujah. To help navigate not just us, but those that are looking to you, those that know that you are a believer. Some of the people are looking for something. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Come on, saints of God. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. People are looking. <clears throat> just when you sit down, <clears throat> just to watch the news for any length of time. My God, my God, if that doesn't put you in, thank you, thank you all for sharing. If that doesn't put you into a focused group, hallelujah. Glory to God, hallelujah. So, <clears throat> Pastor asked me today, Pastor was asking, Pastor said, you know, did I have um, the, the scripture in which we would be speaking from? I mean, you know, we've been dealing with um, on a particular series and, and all day today, I've been hearing this song, the phrase of this song. There's a Shaking in the spirit. There's a shaking in the spirit. And I'm absolutely haven't been able to 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 really <clears throat> release it. You know, because I've you know I've heard it and I and I know Jacqueline Carr sings a song, but I just been hearing her voice just ring in my ear. And I hadn't really heard that song in a, in a, in a long time. But that, 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 but that phrase, there's a shaking in the spirit. There's a shaking 
in the spirit. And I and I uh, uh, went to the word of God. My, 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 my. I went to the word of God. And uh, to see what, where it is that he would have me um, come from tonight. Hallelujah. And um, I want you all to, we're talking about prophecy and the prophetic. Glory to God. If you understand those last week, we were studying from Daniel. And we talked about how much do you weigh, if y'all remember that. And it was talking about how God said, I have weighed you in the balance. I've told, he told King Belshazzar, I have weighed you in the balance. And you've been found deficient. You've been found wanting. You found lacking. Hallelujah. And I'm getting ready to do something about it. And so God was telling us when we were, we really, you know, looking at that scripture on last week and understanding how our heart must be right. Hallelujah. Because that's how God weighs us by the intent of our heart. What your true, what your motives are. What is your agenda? Hallelujah. That's how God looks. See, man will look on the outside. But God, thank you, glory to God, God looks on the heart. Praise God, hallelujah. My, 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 hallelujah. God looks on the heart. And so I've been thanking God. I said, Lord, you know the heart of the matter. You can get down to the heart of the matter. And I thank you for creating in me, this is me, my prayer a clean heart and renewing a right spirit within me. Glory to God. And that's an individual thing. Hallelujah. The way your heart is. Glory to God. And he was, and, and, and the Lord said something on last week, and I hope y'all put a pen in it. I told you all, I said, when God get ready, it doesn't matter your lofty position. It doesn't matter how you may surround yourself. Because as we could see from last week's study, King Belshazzar had in Babylon, they thought they were behind impenetrable walls. They thought nobody could get to them behind those walls. Because only those they let in could get in. But God had to show them, I don't need you to let me in. I come in when I want to come in and how I want to come in. And that was, therefore, you saw the handwriting on that wall. He got the message to him because he wrote a handwriting. Come on, I'm just going, just sort of recapping from last week because we're going to bring you over to this week. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And how many know it doesn't matter? You know, as we looked at, and we've been looking over at the television set all week long, from all weekend long, we see, hallelujah, everything that's going on, regardless of position, regardless of status, hallelujah. God is the great, hallelujah, glory to God. It does say that, Sister Clark, it doesn't matter. Hallelujah, what's that? When God get ready to move and when God ready to speak and when God want to reach you and want God want to get, hallelujah. You know, pride, the Bible says, pride cometh before destruction and a haughty spirit before fall. Hallelujah. So I don't want to ever be caught up in a prideful manner. I always want to humble myself under the mighty hand of God. And he will do the lifting. And God will do that. Hallelujah. I, I am a believer in God. And I, I, I am a believer. So any way I come at you. I'm coming at you. From the point of a believer. 
Glory to God. I'm a believer in the word of God. Hallelujah. I do consider myself enlightened. I do consider myself woke. Glory to God. You hear me? Praise God, saints. As you come on, please like and share. Hallelujah. God bless you, Sister Sheila of Jacksonville. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Listen, saints. Listen to the word of the Lord. Don't you know that it is imperative that you have a foundation that, of which you can stand? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You, it's imperative that you have a foundation upon which you can stand. You know, in Matthew, they was telling them, you say, you have to build your house on a rock, on a solid foundation. Hallelujah. Because when the storms come, and you better believe, in everyone's life, there comes a storm every now and then. There comes rain. There comes situations. There comes circumstances. Good times and bad times. Ecclesiastes tells us to everything there's a season, a time for every purpose. It's, it's written in the book. Hallelujah. So we are not, and remember on last week, I also said, and it, and, it, and it deserves repeating, that seasons come and seasons go. Glory to God. But we are not moved because of the season. We just make preparation. Hallelujah. We're not in fear of the change in season. We just make preparation. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Those of us who see in the change in the weather, we got our sweaters out. I talked to Sister Kim today, and Sister Kim was telling me uh, that it was 38 degrees. Hallelujah. Waking up to 38 degrees. Hallelujah. She still got stuff to do. She can't just lock in because of the season. She just must make preparation. Get the boots. Get the coat. Get the whatever uh, in, in preparation. And so we know that storms are, do come. Sister Kelly, do you hear me what I say? Do you hear me, Sister Kelly? Sometimes storms come, and, but, but, but we don't, we make preparations. Those of us who are from Florida, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, a, I'm from the Sunshine State. And we have, and we are accustomed that at a certain time that we will get what they call hurricane season. We get hurricane season. That didn't stop us from living in Florida because there was hurricane season. What we did was, you know, when we were here, they were those who got the storm doors, storm windows, those who get the sandbags, and we would understand that when the storm comes, sometimes you have to put in extra supplies. I'm going somewhere here. I want y'all to hear me what I'm saying. You, you, we, we would take on extra supplies. Hallelujah. We would go get the water, holler, extra water. We would, my husband would put the generators in place. Come on, somebody, talk to me. We knew that, hallelujah, that a storm would be coming. And then we would pay attention, hallelujah, to the weather report. And but then you would get the warning. That if you lived in a low-lying area, listen, saints, I'm going somewhere here. That if you were living in a low-lying area, or if you were living in a mobile home, you may have to evacuate. Because the foundation of where you are would not be sure enough that it could stand the storm, possibly. So they say, you may have to go. And I'm telling you all, the thing that we have to do is according to the word of God, that we got to sure ourselves up on a firm foundation. Because when the storm comes, and when the wind blows, and when the rain comes, you just, and, they, and sometimes the lights may go out. Glory to God. You're not moved. Glory. Come on, talk to me, saints of God. People of God. Saints of God. Hallelujah. 
You just make preparations. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And the one thing I like, and this is why we talk about prophecy and the prophetic. The one thing I really lack about, uh, 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 th they will give us what we call forewarning. And see, prophet, prophets being attentive to the word, being attentive to around, you know, you get forewarning. Sometimes you get that forewarning. So that you can uh, uh, govern yourself accordingly. Glory to God. That's why it's good, hallelujah, to, to, to live a prayerful life. To stay prayed up. I'm going somewhere here. Glory to God. To pray, stay prayed up. So that you will be uh, 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 prepared. Hallelujah. In the time of storm. So as we're looking out and so many families being impacted in ways they never thought they would. Listen, saints of God, people of God. We're looking at things that we never thought we would see in our lifetime. Can't tell me. It's making us all feel at ease. There's some things making me mighty uneasy. But you know what? We have to still put our trust in an almighty God. Come on, talk to me, saints of God, people of God. Glory to God. Sister, hallelujah. Sister Crawford, come on, Minister Crawford. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on, saints of God. You hear me? Dr. Crawford, do you hear me? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We have to make preparations at whatever lot in life we are. Glory to God. Glory to God. Some things we have to trust. Hallelujah. By way of our prayer. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, doctor. Yes, ma'am. A lot of us. And so, only thing that we can do, prayer works and it reaches. The blood that Jesus shed for me. That song say way back on Calvary. Hallelujah. He said it can reach to the highest mountain. It can flow to the lowest valley. The blood that gives me strength from day to day, it will never lose its power. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We are not defenseless. Glory to God. You hear, you hear, you hear, you hear saints. We are not defenseless. We are not without. But you know what? We got to start these tools to operating. Glory to God. We got to make this stuff get in motion. Yes, right. Stay prayed up. Say it, Sister Knight. We got to stay prayed up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And so, so today, hallelujah, you know, as I was telling you that I, my husband was asking me, well, what we, and I, but I told you, I heard, kept hearing that, 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 that song over and over my head. There's a shaking in the spirit. There's a shaking in the spirit. Glory to God. I just couldn't. I mean, it just it was just like a on a loop in my head. There's a shaking in the spirit. Glory to God. And so, as you all, I want you all to turn with me to uh, Haggai. The book of Haggai. And you know, we've been dealing with um, prophecy and the prophetic for a while. And we've been dealing with a lot of the words of the prophets. Hallelujah. Major and minor prophets. And tonight is un not unlike that. And so I came to this chapter 2 of Haggai. And it's a very interesting book. Hallelujah. And I want you to hear as we was begin reading 
this allow me to read and be a little bit wordy and, and, and so far as that, but it's Haggai, beginning at the first, uh, second chapter, beginning at the first verse. And say, in the seventh month, on the 21st of the month, the word of the Lord came by Haggai the prophet, saying, Speak now to Zerubbabel, the son of Shelitil, governor of Judah, and to Joshua, the son of Jehozak, the high priest, and to the remnant of the people, saying, Who is left among you who saw this temple in its former glory? And how do you see it now? In comparison with it, is this not in your eyes as nothing? Now, historically, you know, we'll look at this, and when they speak of the temple, you know what they're talking about before the destruction, before, you know, we know the whole history of how Israel, what goes on with Judah and Israel. Hallelujah. When they get believing kings, God is with them, and that may, they're doing the right thing. Good morning. Good afternoon, Pastor God. Bless hello, you, man hello. of God. Good to see hallelujah. Pastor Edwards. Thank Amen. So we know historically that, you know, the ups and down of, of how they do, you know, when they're on the trek, when they're believing God and God is with them, you know how that is. But he's bringing up a subject and he said, you remember the former temple, the glory of the temple. Now, see, those of you who know about how Solomon's temple was set up and how the temple of God was before it was destroyed by the Romans. Um, you remember when the 24th chapter of, you know, in the 24th chapter of Matthew, when Jesus came out and he was speaking to his disciples and they were looking at the glory of Solomon's temple at that time. And Solomon's temple, um, you know, it was just the centerpiece of Jerusalem. And Jesus told him, he said, um, you know, there's going to come a time when one stone be left upon another. Hallelujah. Truly, the disciples couldn't really understand that because so they didn't know because Jesus, he just didn't see in the moment. Jesus could see, you know, futuristically. Hallelujah. He was, you know, hallelujah. Glory to God. The word of God was, he was God. In, you know, the word was in him. Hallelujah. He was, he was Christ. Hallelujah. Gee, he was, he was the Christos. He, 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 he wasn't bound just in this, the human form, although he was there, but his spirit man, he could see as a father. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And so he knew, he said that, you know, there won't be one stone left upon another. And history shows that the Romans came in and they destroyed Solomon's temple. Mm -hmm. And even then here, back here at Haggai, Haggai is talking. Hallelujah to to at this time and talking about uh, the former temple of what they historically he's saying. But, you know, today I'm not going to deal with the historical aspect of this scripture. Dr. Crawford, you hear me? I'm finna to deal with the spiritual aspect of it. Glory to God. We want to deal with this thing on a spiritual plane. Hallelujah. So as you hear this and as you listen to this, know that we're going to, uh, uh, look, although we're in a, his, we're reading from this historical book, we're going to bring it with an inspirational, spiritual message. Hallelujah today in the study. Hallelujah. Remember the subject is there's a shaking in the spirit. Mm. That's 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 the subject we're going with uh, tonight. The study we're going. There's a shaking in the shaking. spirit, and so verse um, four says, "Yet now be strong, Zerubbabel, who was then the governor of Judah." We all know what Judah is, and Judah means praise, right? Says the Lord, and be strong, Joshua. God is with us. Hallelujah. Come on now. Son of Jeho Jehozadak, the high priest. And be strong, all you people of the land, says the Lord, and work. For I am with you, says the Lord of hosts. Now, that part, you need to underline it in your book. I want you to highlight it and underline it. Because I, I, I like to know that. Whenever you open this Bible, if it falls on that, I want it to highlight that part that says, I am with you. Hallelujah. I said, that's good news. It's good news to know that God is with you. It's good news to know that God will never leave you, never forsake you, that God is with you. It's good news to know that. 
Yes, yes. It's good news. Somebody better know that it's good news. And he's telling him, he said, I am with you. And there's no greater encouragement to me as a believer than to know that God is with me. Hallelujah. Even when I'm going through a storm, even when in the good times, that encouragement to know that God is with me. That's all I got to know that God is with me. Because when, when, when you are assured and you are reassured and you have that blessed assurance that no matter what's going on, that God is with you. Yes. Glory to God. Glory Somebody to God. say something to me. God is with you. Yes. It's so notable that when you read, hallelujah, back in Exodus, when Moses was leading the children out of, uh, 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 through the wilderness, mm. and when they had made that horrible, they did that horrible thing by building that uh, 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 idol in the wilderness. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then God is saying, you know what? I tell you what, I'm going to destroy you, right? Then y'all know that whole story. And then, then Moses talk who 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 could talk directly to God. Mm -hmm. So God, hallelujah, my glory to God. He said, "No, these your children. That's right. These your people. What would they say if you did?" Then God said, "Well, I tell you what, I'm going to do. You all can still go." He said, "But I'm going to send an angel with you." Hallelujah. Moses looked at God and he said, no, nope, not going to move unless you with us. Hallelujah. You're the one. You're the one. That I need. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory. Because you know when you got God with you. Hallelujah. Then you got everything else that goes along with God. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, yes. Whether it's angels, whether it's whatever, whatever you need. When God is with you, he's, he's all Hallelujah. Com and compensates. Say that, Pastor. More than enough. Pastor says he's more than enough. Yes. Hallelujah. So we got to make sure we, that God is with us. <clears throat> he said, I, when I know that I am with you, mm. he said, I'll never leave you. Mm -hmm. nor for, I'm talking to the I know I'm talking. I'm reaching out to the believers today because I need you all to know this, that God is with us. Right. I don't care. Hallelujah. What your eyes may show you. I don't care what we see on the news. I don't care how, you know, like we said, we feel in some kind of way. Hallelujah. But just, you got to know that God is with us. That's right. Hallelujah. God has always been with us. Yes, yes, God has always been with us. If you just look down through, hallelujah. I had Dr. Crawford on here earlier, but I know she teaches African-American history. But we, should be, we can talk about, talk about it. Talk about it all the way from the middle passages all the way over. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How, 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 how the, the spirit of the Lord is yet with us. Teach us how to survive. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We are, hallelujah, strong. Hallelujah. God is with us. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God is with us. Yes, he is. He said, I'll never leave you. I'll never forsake you. I'll be with you even to the Hallelujah. end of the earth. Hallelujah. Do I have, do I have, I have a people out there listening to the word Glory of the Lord? God. Glory to God. I think it is you come on that you like and you share. And so, Pastor, um, I don't want to just dominate, which is what I generally do, but I just, you know, you want to, you know, say a little bit about this Haggai, this scripture, just a little bit. And, and I'm going to go into it a little bit as we talk about when he, he's talking about that latter temple. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hmm. Well, um, <clears throat> he, he, he was, he was dealing with, 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 with Haggai and good afternoon to everyone. It's, and now, uh, when you are led Be by the strong. Lord, say that. When you are led by the Lord, listen to what I'm saying. When, because what do we have that these, um, that we have that the Old Testament people did not have? We have his spirit that lives in us. Hallelujah. Wow. 
Glory we have his living word. Hallelujah. Glory to, God. Glory to God. We have all this understanding and knowledge and all this history that we can pull from. We are better today than we ever been before. Glory in the God. word of God. In the word of God. There, there's the, uh, uh, we can get the word of God in us uh, um, uh, uh, through us, listen to it in every area of our lives. Glory, glory to God. I mean, good to fast and pray. Holy hallelujah. It's part of it. it that's part of it. But think about it. Uh, um, they literally had to do different things to hear from the Lord. Oh, glory to God. But all we got to do is, Lord, talk to us. Hallelujah. Speak to us, God. And you can open that Bible talking, and he'll talk to you through his word. They didn't have this. They didn't have 66 books. They, the, the, the 66 books were being written. <laughs> they were living. The Hallelujah. Books. They were living the books. That's right. And it's amazing. Books. Hallelujah. On how God is. God is. Be because we need to walk as he walked. Live as he lived. Oh, glory to God. Because God is an awesome God. And we are awesome people. And we can live a, a victorious life. Yes, we can. You know, it's interesting because I, I've been pastor. Like I told you today, he asked me because he, you know, why, you know, where was I coming from t at tonight's Bible study so he can be prepared. And I, and I was kidding with him. I say, well, pastor. I'm coming out the Bible, and I know you know the whole Bible, so it'll be. <laughs> Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. He does. Pastor, he goes through the Bible all you know, all, all throughout the year. He, he he does the Bible all throughout. So I told him, I said, don't matter where I'm coming from. I said, because you know the whole Bible. You already know. <laughs> Praise God. Glory to God. Glory. And, but pastor's, pastor's right on it. God's spirit dwells in us, and this is why I'm going with what I'm saying today. God's spirit lives in us and so and as he says um i am with you says the lord of hosts according to the word that i covenant with you when you came out of egypt see how he did see see he went all the way back mm -hmm. <laughs> that's why moses could 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 have that's why moses could put a handle on god because god told him and when he said, I'm, I'm telling you what, these stiff-necked folk, I'm tired, I'm going to destroy them all. He said, wait a minute. These your people. That's right. You know what you said. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory. See, this is why I'm telling you about knowing the word of God. You can remind God of what he said. That's right. You can remind God of his promises. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You can remind God. You can pray his word back to him. Glory to God. Glory. So I mean, pray his word. If those of you, that's why it's good. Hallelujah. It, when the Bible says singing the, in the hymns, psalms, spiritual psalms, yes. you know, it's good to get this thing in you. Because a lot of times you don't have a natural thing that you could say. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And for those of you, sometimes, you know, I could pray in the spirit. Hallelujah. You can go to praying in the spirit. But then sometimes you just need to go to the word and you need to hear what the word of God say and repeat God's word back to him. That's right. Father, you say, I am, I am healed. Yes. I'm healed. I'm whole. Yes. I, I, by the wounds that's in your side, you Hallelujah. were wounded. Yes, you were. By your stripes, I am healed. healed. You've delivered me. Yes, yes. Praise God. God is speaking to us. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. God, we had a little bit of a disruption, but that's all right. God is with us. Hallelujah. God is with you. Yes, he is. You, 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 you. God is with you. Thank you, Lord. You know, the thing, and I'm going to let you know, even in this. So, According to the word that I covenant with you when you came out of he, this is historically, he's talking mm -hmm, to mm -hmm. the children of Judah right now. Okay? He said, My spirit remains among you. Do not fear. All right. I hope that's I hope that's inspirational to somebody. I hope that 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 that's speaking to somebody right there. He said, My spirit, listen, my spirit mm -hmm. remains in you. Do not not fear. You see, the way we can get caught up 
is when you allow fear mm -hmm. to rest on you. And we are not to let fear rest because we know his spirit should rest through God's spirit should rest through and abide because he has not given us the spirit. spirit fear. So says Timothy, right? But of love, what else? Power, Power. and of a sound, sound mind. mind. See, see, no, but true. so sometimes when you don't know what's going on, when you can't see when it's dark. Remember I told you, you know, when the storm comes, sometimes the lights go out. Sometimes it's dark. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory. But you got to still know that God is with you. Hallelujah. You got to still know I'm grabbing hold to God. I'm, 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 I'm secure in the foundation. The foundation of God standeth sure. Yes. That's why when it tells you in Matthew, when we talked earlier this, this, this evening, when I said, make sure that you build your house on a firm foundation. foundation. Won't you build your faith, build your hope on things eternal. Yes. Glory to God. Glory. The foundation of God standeth sure. Yes. Winds can come. Hallelujah. Winds can blow. But we stand sure on a firm foundation firm of God. Firm foundation. For thus says the Lord of hosts. Verse 6. It is a little while I will shake heaven and earth, the sea and dry land. How about she got a little shot out of both sides? Our subject today was a shaking in the spirit. That's right. God's letting you know. It's a shaking up. But it's not for naught. Hear ye word of the Lord. Some things I can say. I'm just trying not to be. Uh, uh, I'm trying to continue to be politically correct. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Stay in the vein of the. Of, 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 of speaking God's word. Not my opinion. My, my feelings. Glory to God. That's the safe place for, for us. Hallelujah. That we speak as an oracle of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That as we speak prophetically to you today, inspire, hallelujah, edifying, hallelujah, and encouraging your heart today, know that God is with us. Fear not. That's right. Because there will be a, there is a shaking. Because uh, um, fear can come to be a snare to you. It can come and stop you in your very tracks. But when you know where God is, you don't care. Listen, you don't care who's in the White House. You don't care who's in uh, uh, what ranch, ranch a, go a government because God is with you. God controls the heart even of the king. God controls the heart of whoever's in power. Can you turn it? Your Where prayers, you? your prayers... Your prayers are as effective. Your prayers is effective. And and, and he's not giving us a spirit. But he said, he don't even fear man. Hallelujah. Because the fear of man can be a stare to you. My God. My oh, God. glory to God. My God. We thank God that we got to learn and grow that way. You don't, you don't start off that way. But as you build, as you grow, as you mature in the Lord, your fear will be less and less and less. And, and, and this part. This is this is where I'm want to go with this. He says, he says, I will shake heaven and earth, the sea and dry land. Mm -hmm. Now you just look around. Hmm. How powerful God! The, is. How, let's look around. There's some stuff going on. Hallelujah! Man, quote, quite understand it. We looked over there, out there in California, where all those fires and things were going on. My daughter sent me a picture of a, the, t the temperature, and it was the highest temperature it had ever been. And God said, Pastor, want me to make sure I read this. Hallelujah. That I will shake all nations. That's right. <laughs> I'm just speaking. That's right. I'm talking today. You better say that, Sister Clark. God is in control. And he said, I will shake all nations and they shall come to desire and, and, and shall come to the desire of all nations. I will. Listen, the temple. Hallelujah. This temple. Feel this temple. Yes. Glory to God. 
there's a shaking. Hallelujah. In the spirit. Glory to God. And, and God doesn't want us to be in a fear place. No. He doesn't want fear to be a factor. No. Hallelujah. Because we got to be in our posture of prayer and praise. Hallelujah. And purpose during this pandemic. That's right. Glory to God. Don't let, don't get, don't get, we are on the foundation that we are built on. That even when the shaking occurs, even when the rattling occurs. Hallelujah, pastors. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You hear me, all, all my pastors that's out there. God bless you. Thank you, Lord. Don't you know, even when we, yes, 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 Pastor Thank Randolph, you, God bless you. Even when we are seeing what we're seeing yes. and we hear God saying what he's saying, we're not moved That's right. to fear, but we are moved to continue to speak God's word. Hallelujah. We are moved because the Bible is that there's a shaking Jesus. in the spirit. Glory to God. We see it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And just like the spirit of the Lord is being our, we were talking about the, the meteorologists in the natural, letting us know when there's a storm out on the ocean. Well, they let us know when it's moving this away. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And this the same way. Hallelujah. That right now, hallelujah, the meteorologists in the spirit, hallelujah, those that are got their ear to the Lord, you can know, hallelujah, what the spirit of the Lord is saying yes, to the church. Yes. yes. Glory to Glory God. God. Hallelujah. God. The spirit is speaking. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he's letting us know we must be on a firm foundation. Amen. Because if your house is built on sand, you're subject to fall down. Hallelujah. But if you're built on the word, the foundation of the word of God. When those storms come and when the winds blow, hallelujah, you can feel it rattling out there. Jesus. But when you know, hallelujah, that you are, ha <laughs> when you know, but you know that you know that you know, Amen. when you sit down there looking at the news, uh, you can, you can, you can feel like you can feel the wind blowing. Jesus. Whereas you sit there and look at the news, you feel the wind blowing. Huh? But I'm going to tell you right now, huh, it's something about being on a firm foundation. That's right. Even though the lights may flicker, <laughs> we're not moved. Jesus. Glory to God. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We got to be on that anchored on that solid rock. Sister Pam, you hear that? We must be anchored on that solid rock, rock. that foundation of Jesus Christ. Yes. My, 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 my. Glory to God. Jesus. Don't you hear ye the word? Hear ye the word of the Lord, saints. Hear ye the word of the Lord. Hallelujah. There's a shaking. Like I said, I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't. That song was in a loop in my ear. And when Pastor asked me, I said, I, I, he asked me, and I said, Pastor, I, I just, you know, I had to, you know, go here for what the Lord was saying. Hallelujah. That we, there's a shaking. Jesus. There's a movement. Hallelujah. But see, sometimes all that has to be done. Hallelujah. Because some things might have to get out the way. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yes. Some yes. things might have to be changed. Hallelujah. The landscape may not look. And just like you all know, after certain storms, it changes the whole landscape. Let me put, put, put that. Can I put that right there? Can I, mm. can I put that right there? Hallelujah. Put that right there. Jesus. After certain storms, sometimes it changes the whole landscape. Glory to God. That's right. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I was just, just to know that God is with us. That's what I was just to know. And I was just to know that we are continue, hallelujah, to stand fast in the liberty, whereas Christ, wherewith Christ has made us free. He's made us free. Hallelujah. We're, we're not bound. Hallelujah. We're free to pray. We're free to worship. We're free to give. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Yes. A unified prayer. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Because we know God is in control. Yes, he is. He told us last week. 
People who think they're behind impenetrable walls are not. God said, if I got to come under the door, I'm going to show you the writing on the wall. God told us that just last week. He said, you've been weighing in the balance and found wanting, which means you've been found with a deficit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I need you to, I'm finna let you know who's in control. That's right. I'm finna let you know that. God said that. Amen. God said that. He showed, she told King Belshazzar, who thought that he, he, he could be behind his walls and not be reached. Mm -hmm. God said, no. God said, I got to show you who's in control. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God, saints of God, Amen. people of God. Hallelujah. God is letting us know. And we see it. We see it. We see it throughout. And he says, verse 7, I will shake all nations. See, there's something different about God shaking. It's different than an earthquake. It's different than a whole bunch of stuff. When there's a spiritual shake. Sister Val, you hear me what I say? When there's a spiritual shake. By God, my God, my God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Come on, saints of God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hear ye the word of the Lord, saints. Thank you, God. When God starts the shaking, he gets all our attention. Mm -hmm. When God starts to shake, he gets the attention of the nations. Hallelujah. My, 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 my. As you look around this whole world, they're all dealing with some semblance of the same thing. Glory to God. Glory. Glory to God. But we're Glory not to, to fear. We're to trust in God. We're to lean wholly and depend thoroughly on him. Amen. This is the day that the Lord hath made. Yes, it is. We shall rejoice and be exceedingly glad in it. We shall, we shall put our trust wholly lean and depend on the Lord. Amen. And I'm telling you right now, saints, no matter what you see, no matter what you hear, let your house be built on a firm foundation. That's right. Build your house on the rock. Because when you're built on the rock, when the storms come, Amen. when the winds blow, mm. come on now. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When the lights go out, Hallelujah. When it's all over, hallelujah. You have, you have, you know that you've already, you've gone and you've stacked up on your supplies. I heard my, 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 my friend, hallelujah. God bless you. God bless you, Dr. Verse. I heard my friend, Sister Val, my God sister there, when she was telling me, she said the Lord spoke to her at the beginning of this pandemic. He spoke to her and let her know, you know, and she went and she stocked up on so many supplies where people were finding it hard to get. The Lord had already spoke to her about, stock, you know, stocking up on the Lysol, stocking up on the alcohol, stocking up on them different things. So she was prepared. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When many was out there trying to yeah, hustle and bustle. Right? Hallelujah. No, this is the rubbing alcohol. <laughs> Glory to God. I, I, oh Hallelujah. Glory to God. Yeah, and then there was preparation. And, but that's all. That and that's what God <laughs> makes it for us. That's what God does for us. He lets us know. Storms may come. Amen. But you just be on the solid foundation. You Amen. just be on the rock of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Winds may blow, but what you do is you be on the rock of Jesus Christ. That's Jesus. what you do. You be on the rock of his word. You be in the foundation of his word. Because the foundation of God standing. Hallelujah. Glory to, about our son, not a shot talk. Glory to God. Y'all, am I speaking today? Hallelujah. Do you hear the word of the Lord today? God want us to understand. Hallelujah. You're going to see a lot of, there's a shaking in the spirit. There's a, hallelujah. Jesus. But we're not to fear. We're to secure ourselves. Hallelujah. In the foundation of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. That we are Amen. built. Hallelujah. On the rock. 
Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory Amen. to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We thank God for our teacher today. Glory to God. Hand. Hallelujah. We appreciate her today. And, and uh, uh, we just thank God for the book of Haggai. And uh, uh, we just appreciate the, the minor prophets. But, um, uh, she was reading that verse 8 there. Um, uh, I mean, that verse 7. I will shake all the nations. And what is declared by all nations will come. And I will fill their houses with glory. Listen, listen at that. Saith the Lord Almighty. Verse 8. The silver is mine. The gold is mine. Declares the Lord Almighty. That means everything belongs to the Lord. It all belongs Hallelujah. To so he can adjust it. He can, aff he, he can focus it the way he needs to. Yes. We don't need to worry about yes. what man is doing. Yes. Oh, hallelujah. Because God is awesome. Trust in him. He is Woo! trustworthy. He's trustworthy, y'all. He's trustworthy. Get to know him. If you don't know how, how trustworthy he is, you need to get to know him more. Because he's trustworthy. Glory. He has our best interests Interest. in mind. Hallelujah. Holy, he, he's already prepared things for us. Glory to God. He, he already got the table prepared. In the he presence. already got. He already. He already got things already built. He already planned in advance Woo, for gotta, us. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God! Glory for to God, God know what He's doing. God trust God. in Him. Trust. Don't trust in yourself. Don't hallelujah. trust just on, on your intellect. Don't trust on just your money, your 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 prestige, your status in life. Trust God. God looks on the heart. Hallelujah. hallelujah. That don't mean we don't need nobody. We, we need people down here to help us go. Glory to God. I appreciate my wife. I appreciate the, 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 the church members. I appreciate everyone. I appreciate my family members. But I thank God for my full trust is in the Lord. For I know that he's able to do everything he said he would do. Everything he said he would do. Hallelujah. He would do. It's already said, he already said yes and amen for me because I'm his child. Glory to God. Glory to I God. I was made in his image, in Glory his likeness. To I'm his child. God. Yes. He knew me before I was even born. I'm, I know that God, he knows not only me, he knows you. Hallelujah. He knows where you came from. He knows where you're going. Glory to God. Stay with God. Hallelujah. Stay with him. And if you if you don't know him, get to know him right now. Hallelujah. Just, just repeat after me. Say, Lord, forgive, forgive me. me. Help me. Help me. Help me, Lord, in every way, God. Yes, Forgive God. me of my sins. Yes, God. Help me, Lord, to, to come into your presence. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for showing me Hallelujah. the right way that I need to go, yes, Lord. God. Thank you, Lord, for filling me with your spirit. Hallelujah. Your power. Yes, God. Oh, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, oh Lord. Father, we love you. We praise, praise you. We you. magnify you. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Lord, Father, we thank, thank you, God. Lord, with all our hearts, mind, and soul. We thank you, Lord, for this, everything you've done that you're doing for us. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. For Lord, we know that you are God and, and there's, there's no, no other. other. Thank you, Lord, for how you touch us, yes, how you yes, help yes. us ha. right now Glory. in the name of Jesus. Yeah, 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 yeah. For Lord, yeah, yeah, you're yeah, the God. one Hallelujah. that make us effective. You're the one that give us the power to reach the world. You're the one that give us the power to reach the nations. You're the one that give us the power to do what we need to do, God. Oh, Father, you're the one. Glory. Thank you, Lord, for touching your people this day. Touching those that don't know you, God. In the name of Jesus, to have a Ooh, heart and a mind yes. to know you, God. Yes. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord, for your forgiveness. Thank you, Lord, for your love right now. In the name of Jesus. And, Lord, we give you the glory, honor, and praise. And, Father, we thank you, Lord, for those that have given and the offering, to those that have sent the cash apps, those that have mailed to the post office box. We thank you, Father, for those that just drop by and, and, and drop it off. Oh, Father, we love you. We praise you. We magnify you. We thank you, Lord, for everyone that's given today. Bless them in every way, every aspect of their life. Yes. And Jesus said, we do pray. You are a shepherd. Yes. We shall not want. You yes. are a provider for yes. every hour. And Jesus said, we pray. Amen, 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 amen and amen. 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 Thank you so much. God bless you. God bless you, a woman of God. Hallelujah. Those of you who shared your cash outs for us. Yes, we did get it. Thank God for you. God bless you so much. Hallelujah. We love you. When you all stop by and show the love and support. Hallelujah. Amen. We appreciate you so Amen. much. We also thank God. Hallelujah. For our chief presiding prelate, Bishop Howard McMillan and Lady McMillan. No, we love you. We thank God for our family and friends at um, Faith Christian Family Center and Faith Family Ministries in the 
International. Don't you know we love you? Hallelujah. We thank God for you. Hallelujah. We thank God for the saints of Artesian Christian Center who's always there. Hallelujah. On Sunday. Hallelujah. We came back. Hallelujah. And to having in-person services for Sunday only. But it was beautiful and we thank God for being with us. Hallelujah. In that. Hallelujah. And again, we'll be back. Hallelujah. But we're still streaming on streaming live. And so, hallelujah, those that cannot be in the service, hallelujah, we ask that you continue to um, come on in, hallelujah, and slack and share how those will be coming on later. Hallelujah, we thank God for you. Jesus. Thank God for each and every one of you. We've gotten, hallelujah, those love gifts in the mail. Thank you. Thank you. We so appreciate it. Know that we are praying for you name by name and one by one. Everyone that's on here, we got so much happening. Hallelujah. I ask that you please keep. Hallelujah. We pray for our dear sister Green. Hallelujah. We love you, dear. Hallelujah. We thank God for the Green family as you're, they're going through. Hallelujah. And uh, got word today about some other people. Hallelujah. Um, friends over in Tallahassee that passed away. Hallelujah. But we are thanking God. Hallelujah. For he's a comforter. Thank you, Lord. He's a keeper. Hallelujah. And he does all things well. Hallelujah. And so we as pastor pray today, we keep our focus and our eyes on God. Yes. Hallelujah. We are Thank keeping you, our eye on not what we see, not what it feel like, and not what it look like. Jesus. But we are moved and we on a firm foundation of the word of God. Hallelujah. We thank God for you. Amen. We look forward to you being back Hallelujah. on this 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 program yes, on yes. Sunday at 1045. Thank you, Hallelujah. Lord. Thank you, God Lord. bless you and keep you is our prayer. We love you. Hallelujah. Love you. Hallelujah. Say, Lord, Lord, we thank you, we thank you for the victory, for the victory, our Lord and Savior, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, victory over sin, victory over sin, victory over sickness, victory over, sickness, victory over, anything, victory over anything that's, not like, that's you. not like you. Thank you, Lord, thank you, Lord, for forgiving for me, for forgiving me, for saving me, saving me, for filling me, filling me with your Holy, with your Spirit. Holy Spirit. In Jesus' in name, Jesus name. Amen. 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 And amen. amen. Y'all have an awesome, awesome and wonderful week. But God has a blessing for you. For you. You, you and, and especially, especially you, do. you expect good things to happen. Good things, to you. good things, good things. Yeah. Hallelujah. God expect bless it. you. Remember, there's a shaking in the spirit. Yeah, we love you. It. One and all. God bless Hallelujah. you. Hallelujah. God bless you.